everyone, Lewis here, and I thought I'd bring some recent news relating to Pokemon Go. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. I do apologize for the lack of a video last week because of the fact there was hardly any material to work with, but I do have a lot to cover in this video, like... So far, the search for Zyrude special research and event is now live in Pokemon Go. Went live last week and it ends next week. You have time to complete the limited time special research and catch the mythical Pokemon Zyrude, which of course is connected to the new Pokemon movie which was first released in Japan, but delayed because of what's going on in the world. And of course, Explorer Pikachu is back. And so are Jesse and James. You can get photobombed by them three times a day, which will give you either a Meowth, Cantonian Meowth, or a Wobbuffet. If you're lucky, you might get a Shiny from those encounters, and Jesse and James's Meowth Balloon is also back for this event as well. And of course, also making its debut into Pokemon Go is Genesect Douse Plate. Because Douse Plate form has a blue plate on its back behind the cannon on this Pokemon. And of course, no shiny variant of this mythical is available as we speak, as of this recording. And of course, this Sunday is Duskull Community Day, which will be from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. local time, depending on which part of the world you are in. In other Pokemon news, also announced the Pokemon Go Championship Series in collaboration with the Pokemon World Championships. They'll be coming out sometime in 2022. And of course, you can register. You have until Monday, November 20th. 29th, 2021 to complete the current Battle League season. And if you do Battle League the next season, it'll get you an entry to compete. To register for these events, competitors will need to link their Pokemon Go account to their Pokemon Trainer Club account in order to, to participate. And of course, this marks a milestone. Trainer Battles will be returning to the main stage next year where, where you'll be competing against other trainers around the world. One more thing. I'll be live streaming tonight, Spotlight Hour, for Driftloom, 6 p.m. to 7 p.m., depending on which part of the world you are in, which of course is also when Driftloom Spotlight Hour goes live, which of course should already be happening depending on which part of the world you are in by the time I release this video. I'll also be live streaming Raid Hour for Genesect Douse Plate tomorrow at the same time. And I'll be live streaming Thursday sometime late in the afternoon or early evening until a certain point. Because this Saturday I'll be going scuba diving up at Dutch Springs for my next documentary which will be a follow up to the video I did last year. And I'll also be doing a live stream from up there, but a brief and short one though, 
where I'll be talking about what I'll be doing for my upcoming day at Dutch Springs. And then this Sunday, I will not only be making a video about Dutch Skull Community Day, I will also be streaming Dutch Skull Community Day after I finish the said video. Thanks for watching, everyone! You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and Twitch. And remember, it's time for adventure! Also, during these times when heading out, wear a mask in public indoor settings, practice social distancing, carry hand sanitizer with you, wash your hands, and lastly, and most importantly, get vaccinated, and of course, stay safe, stay healthy, and together, we are finally getting through these dark times together, but we're not out of the woods just yet.